Without any doubt, the integral part of an EV is its battery, which delivers the juices. There's a whole lot of development going around the battery technology to push its limits, so that the EV industry can also reap benefits out of it. And as the EV industry leader, the new addition of the Trillion Dollar Company Club, Tesla has recently shared their work on developing the new battery, which they're calling the 4680. And if you believe all the things that are going around about some of the features, then it will be quite a battery. Tesla hasn't announced all the features officially, and even yet, the battery seems unstoppable. How? Let's gain a little insight. Tesla was content buying cells with its proprietary chemistry from its suppliers, but saw issues on the horizon. Tesla aims to grow consistently at a rate of 40 to 50% per year, and to do that, it's going to need more and more batteries. Tesla's battery forecasts showed a gap between the production limits of its battery cell suppliers and Tesla's internal demand for its automotive and energy storage businesses. To solve this, Tesla's teams have been hard at work buying and designing new technical solutions to drive further improvements in the battery cell format. Improved Dimension Currently, the 2170 batteries are standard in the new Tesla models and Elon Musk is ready to take the next step in the case of the Tesla batteries with the 4680 batteries. Well, the news of Tesla working on the 4680 batteries is not any recent news. Elon Musk mentioned the battery development back in the battery day of 2020. Tesla is one of the only automakers using cylindrical cells, and the additional energy capacity of the new 4680 cells isn't magic. It's simply a lot larger than the current ones Tesla employs. The 4680 gets the name from its dimensions, actually, having a diameter of 46 mm and a height of 80 mm. It means that this cell is more than twice the diameter of the 2170 type currently used in most Tesla cars, and 10 mm longer. If you want a volume-based idea, the 4680 is 5.5 times larger than the 2170 cells. Increased Manufacturing Efficiency the reason for the 4680 battery being a better choice starts from the very production process. It has a tabless structure and has a direct impact on improving manufacturability. Not only does the tabless design eliminate the need for a tab, it eliminates the need for the production lines to pause to add the tabs. The new tabless cells eliminate this bump in the road, enabling a manufacturing line that is less prone to manufacturing defects as it hums along rolling up and spitting out massive 4680 cells. Also, the structure of the table is meant to involve dry electrode production that not only helps in reducing manufacturing steps, but also uses different materials for the anodes and cathodes. Not only that, the improvement that does a lot of the heavy lifting to enable using a larger form factor is the tabless design. Eliminating the tabs reduces the internal resistance within the cell caused by the extra component. Internal resistance translates to more heat generation, a more complex manufacturing process, and higher costs, so the tabless design will be sure to get rid of those. Tesla also claims that there will be a 100-fold increase in battery production by 2030 thanks to the new battery type. In September 2020, Musk claimed that by September 2021, Tesla would hit around 10 gigawatts per hour capacity producing the new cells. However, in 2020, the production yield was a paltry 20%, so the 4680 will be improving those numbers for sure. While the 4680 seems to need less steel in its manufacturing stages, according to experts, the bigger can of batteries brings big benefits. Each jelly roll cell packs more in active battery material and less wasted space in the metal casing. A so-called structural battery pack, touted as a Tesla innovation, is in fact already a staple of several EVs, especially in China. That saves more space by trading multiple module cases for a more streamlined pallet of cells wired in parallel. They suggest that Tesla's redesigned pack, including adhesive bonds between cells and modern welding techniques, will reduce steel use by 30 to 40 percent. Stamped grid plates on top will bring power back to terminals. Better Performance One of the results of these efforts is a new 4680 tabless cylindrical battery cell format 
that brings a host of performance on top of manufacturing advantages. The larger jelly roll packs more active battery material into the casing for a five times more improvement in energy storage and a six times increase in power. If Tesla can pull off in-house vertically integrated battery manufacturing and the cell performs as advertised, the 4680 could fuel Musk's dreams to build millions of EVs a year around the world. Tesla's goals, including boosting driving range by more than 50%, 16% of that due to 4680's newfound punch, while having battery costs and bringing a $25,000 Tesla to showrooms. Tesla continues to dominate EV sales in America, but its seemingly insurmountable lead in driving range is under assault. Cost Reduction and last, but not the least, one of the most important factors that Tesla, with all the EV manufacturers around the world, is trying to achieve is cost efficiency. When it comes to cost, the 4680 also shines quite brightly. Tesla's redesign of the battery, cathode, and vehicle frame translates to an expected improvement of 56% in Tesla's cost per kilowatt hour. That's a game changer for Tesla and will enable a completely new generation of low-cost electric vehicles. It all starts with the humble battery cell. 18% improvement cost in kilowatt per hour as a result of the 10 times manufacturing footprint reduction and 10 times manufacturing energy consumption reduction. 14% improvement coming from the change in cell form factor. Improvements in the cathode material cost a 12% reduction in cost. The Meteor batteries will also become part of the car's structure, allowing Tesla to remove chassis elements used purely to provide a stiff casing for the cells, saving car weight and maximizing the space available. Availability In April, Musk said that a reliable 4680 volume was 12 to 18 months away, which would push this closer to 2023. However, at Battery Day 2020, Musk was promising 100 gigawatt hours of production by 2022, which was clearly beyond optimistic. Fortunately, it appears things have improved recently, with production yields now at 70 to 80 percent. The 4680 battery pack will be having a massive impact on the upcoming Tesla models. This is why it is essential that Tesla rapidly solve the problems it has been having with its 4680 cells. Its next set of vehicle enhancements and new vehicles including the Cybertruck, Semi, and mysterious $25,000 Model 2, all depend on this technology, and it will face increasingly stiff competition. To ensure the perfect implementation of plans, Tesla is also seeking help from its battery supplier Panasonic, and they recently shared the world with the first-ever prototype of the 4680 battery. While Panasonic has only specified 2022 as a production start target, its battery CEO has stated that, in terms of product development, the technological goals have largely been achieved, and that it expects to receive an order from Tesla as soon as the cell can be put into production. That's all for now. I hope you've learned all about the new Tesla 4680 battery being unstoppable already. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't, and turn on notifications so you're up to date on the channel's updates. See you in the next video!